we know as soon as that bell rings, you know, it's game time, you know, you got the other person's back. When the tones drop, we're ready for anything. We put our game face on and we go after it. My community depends on me. You know that you've helped somebody when you go to bed at night. Whether you've always dreamed of being a firefighter, or you're just looking for a way to get involved in your community, Southern Stone County Fire Protection District has an opportunity for you. As a volunteer fire department, we depend on men and women just like you to step up and serve your neighbors. People want to give back, they want to help their community, and being on Southern Stone County Fire Protection District is a wonderful way to to give back. I'd say the best part about uh, being a firefighter is definitely helping the community out. Don't necessarily have the time, but I make the time. Our slogan, neighbors helping neighbors, and we are just, you know, ordinary people until that call comes out. When you join Southern Stone County Fire, you're not just joining the fire department, you're becoming a member of a skilled, tight-knit team. Southern Stone County Fire is something to be proud of. We, we are an awesome fire district. You get a sense of pride, a sense of belonging and being here. I would put any volunteer from Southern Stone up with any paid firefighter. I feel they have the same knowledge, the same training. I would go into a fire, any fire with anyone. Anyone on this department, I would walk straight in that front door with them. Every day at the fire station brings new challenges. Uh, there is no, you know, dull moment in firefighting. Every day, something new happens. It's never the same thing. Oh, it's an immediate adrenaline rush when the paper goes off. It's, you never know what it's going to be. Car wreck, medical call, structure fire. And the men and women of Southern Stone County Fire Protection District receive training for just about every situation imaginable. When they first get on the fire department here at Southern Stone, we'll run them through a basic class, basic hands-on with ladders, protective clothing, air packs. They pay for all your training. The training is very intense. We got a saying that's called train like you fight. And we train very hard. Once you get to the basic class, you get a pager and you can start making calls with the fire department. But the training doesn't stop with your first call. We offer so many different classes, firefighter one, firefighter two, uh, they can graduate up to officer one, officer two, instructor one, instructor two. There's just a multitude of classes that they can take. And volunteers at Southern Stone County are fortunate to train on high-tech equipment that one would expect only to find in much bigger cities, including a state-of-the-art burn trailer that gives you a chance to experience real heat without the danger of a real fire. As far as the, the training they give out, the education, and the operations, Southern Stone is one of the best departments I've ever seen. It's definitely a blessing to have the training that we do, the facilities that we do. I feel like I get a full education every time I get through a class. Some volunteers even take their commitment to the next level by joining a special team. You can become a first responder, train for water rescues, high and low angle rescues, even hazardous material emergencies. But no matter how much time you have to devote to volunteering, there's a job for everyone. Any age can volunteer. There's always something to do in the volunteer fire department. We have, uh, you know, people 84 years old still volunteer and help us out just as much as they did when they started. We have people that just drive trucks. We have people that just help out on scene safety. I was 43 years old when I joined the fire department. At 44, I became Rookie of the Year. If I can do it, anybody can do it. For those who have an early interest in the fire service, the Explorer program allows high school students to train and participate with the firefighters. The Explorer program is a Boy Scouts of America sponsored program for youth ages 14 to 18 to get involved in different occupations. They're able to do the drills with us. They're able to go into our new burn trailer. They're getting mentors and role models in the older firefighters and the officers. They can show them the path and show them the tools that they need to learn to, uh, to become successful firefighters. It's helped me mature more and helped me make better decisions and it's just been a great part of my life. My kids have definitely became better men as a result of being on Southern Stone Fire District. For those volunteers considering a professional career in the fire service, Southern Stone County is proven to be a great start. Currently we've got four Southern Stone volunteers on staff here at Logan Rodgeville Fire Protection District. 
they've been well-rounded, they've known, been able to come to work, and we've been able to put them, put them right on a truck. they brought to us, you know, experience that they've gained here through the training. Uh, they've had certifications, which we require, and have also made it uh, a cost-effective for our department to hire people who come in with these certifications already on board. Volunteers wanting to get into the career service, Southern Stone is a, is a good place to start. We'll constantly look at Stone County as, a, as a, a very fertile mining area for us to try to get recruits. But being a volunteer firefighter is not for everyone. It takes a special kind of person to give so selflessly of their time and talents. We are not getting paid to do this. When we get out there and we run our blue lights and sirens, we are on our own time. We're separating ourselves from our jobs, from our families. We do jobs that some people make six figures a year for, for nothing. We do it because we love our community, we, we love the job. Being a volunteer firefighter uh, is 100% uh, commitment. The stress level is high, you know, uh, you know, you get calls at 2 o'clock in the morning, and sometimes you stay up till 6 o'clock and live on two hours of sleep. I have a full-time job and a part-time job. Juggling a lot of times can be very time-consuming, but if you want it bad enough, you can. It's a sacrifice that uh, all of us make. It's a worthwhile sacrifice. You are the one that's helping these people. It's nobody else. And while the sacrifices are great, what you gain as a firefighter is even greater. In the fire department, it's just like a second family. There's a great brotherhood that we have here at Southern Stone. We get our job done, but then when the job's over with, you know, we force around and we go out. I consider everybody here my brothers and sisters. There's nothing we wouldn't do for each other. The brotherhood and sisterhood in the fire department is unlike anywhere else. You have to have 100% trust in the people that you're with. In some of the situations you get into, you're actually putting your life in their hands. We will never leave a person behind. Never. If we go in with you, you're coming out with us. The new family you gain is just one of the countless rewards of volunteering. When they make that call, they're, they're having the worst day ever. And being able to go there and help them through that day it just gives me more joy than anything I do. When we saved their house or we pulled a victim out and the families all got together and they know everybody's all right and I just see the smiles on their faces. It just satisfies me on the inside. And the best thing in the world is when we get there in time and we save something and you can see somebody's happy because you found their wedding ring or pictures. Stuff that means something to them. It makes you feel good that hey I did something good today. I, I helped out someone that I don't even know. Now both of our kids look up to both of us like angels, they're heroes. The biggest reward they get is somebody coming up off the street and just telling them that they appreciate what the fire department does for them. That's better than any kind of money that could be had. If you've got the passion, we've got a position for you. If we didn't have volunteers, there would not be a fire department. We're always looking for new recruits because we're an ever-growing district. Volunteering on a fire department is definitely rewarding above and beyond any monetary value that you could ever get from it. This would be probably one of the biggest and one of the best decisions you've ever made in your life. We don't do it for the pay, we don't do it for the glory, we do it for our community.